So I played the brand new Party Royale mode that Battle Royale got and as I was playing the mode two things came into my mind that I want to talk about in this video and of course my supporter creator code it's Salvaje and it, it is your boy yes Salvaje and Salvaje Cartel and I'm back uh, with another video another one of my save little discussion videos uh, I want to talk about two things the first thing that I want to talk about is well three things the first thing that I want to talk about is this Party Royale mode in Battle Royale, it's so cool and it has so much potential. I mean, some folks are looking at it as it's kind of just a wasted mode. You come in here to, to waste your time. It's not really something that I see myself using, but I see something different. You could go into this Party Royale mode, you know, you could meet some people and then you could go straight into a duels match with them from this Party Royale mode. You know, in the future, we're probably going to go into this Party Royale mode to see the battle pass, to see the challenges, to see possibly new events, to see concerts in this Party Royale island. There's a lot of potential in this um, sort of area or this mode. And when I looked at the potential that it has for Battle Royale, obviously as a Save the World content creator and player, I started thinking of the potential that this thing has for Save the World. And I also got a bit sad that Save the World didn't really get a mode like this because this mode would be perfect for Fortnite Save the World. That leads me to two key points that I want to make throughout this video. Honestly guys, one of the reasons why I'm always uh, sort of having a positive outlook towards the future of Save the World, despite the fact that I'm very vocal when it comes down to some of the negative things that also plague Save the World is, I don't really compare Save the World to Battle Royale. I've said it before and I'm going to say it again, but I think the mindset, Battle Royale got this, why didn't Save the World get it? It's very idiotic. Battle Royale is making billions of dollars a month and Save the World is probably making less than $500,000 a month and Epic isn't forced to put Battle Royale money into Fortnite Save the World. I'm very grateful that Fortnite Save the World exists because sometimes I think that Fortnite Save the World shouldn't even exist in the first place due to the low amount of players that this game has. So that's the first thing that I wanted to talk about, right? Yes, it's true. It sucks that we didn't get Party Royale for uh, Save the World, guys, but I think we should actually be very, very thankful. And the reason why we should be thankful is because Epic said that they're working on a new feature and they're very excited to announce it. So are you guys thinking what I'm thinking? That we're going to get disappointed by Epic Games because in the past when they say they're working on a massive new feature, let's just take a look at the history right? when it comes down to Save the World. Massive new features were a Twine revamp, which was pretty much a Twine revamp, just adding more missions. Um, Storm Shield defense revamps, they said that was massive and it was pretty much just Endurance, so Frost Knight basically and um, war games, so basically challenge the horde. Uh, another major thing that they uh, talked about is Mythic Weapons and the Mythic Storm King, which was basically the Mythic Storm King fight. So every time you know, Epic Games have said that they're adding something majorly new into Save the World, it's honestly not something that major, that massive. The last major thing that we got was the hero rework though, and that was awesome. I love the hero rework, honestly. Like the, the ability to have all of these great loadouts and stuff, it's amazing, all right? I love, love, love that they did that. Um, but, you know, I, I don't really want to get my hopes up too much when it comes down to this major feature that apparently they're working on, but I do want to say this. That's, this is the second thing that I want to talk about in this video. This major new feature, guys, might be a hub for Fortnite Save the World, like Party Royale. If we get a hub for Fortnite Save the World, that would be so amazing. I want to talk about the three things that I would think would be awesome from a hub, having a hub like Party Royale and Fortnite Save the World, which hopefully Epic is working to bring into Save the World. And um, to be honest, if they're gonna do something like Party Royale, it's probably gonna take them maybe two years or a year and a half, since it took them like a year and, uh, prob actually no, yeah, like a year and a half actually to bring the locker to Fortnite Save the World, somewhere around there, okay? A hub for Fortnite Save the World would be amazing. Let's say that I want to farm a specific mission in Twine Peaks, okay? Oh man, like I can't farm this specific mission in Twine Peaks, so someone's joining. Then what I could do is I would go into the Save the World hub and I could find players to, to do the mission with right there. You know, I also see that potential for Battle Royale. Like you go into this Party Royale hub and you can go straight from a duos match or a solos match uh, from this Party Royale thingy. Uh, so you go into Party Royale and you find someone to play duos with. So. Again, the same similar thing could happen in Save the World if Save the World gets a hub mode like this. All right, I can't do a mission with a specific player. Guess what? 
I'm going to go into the hub and I'm going to find people to do the mission with. That would be so amazing. The second thing that a hub would, um, you know, sort of bring to the table in Fortnite Save the World, maybe we could get like an actual trading system in Fortnite Save the World where you go into this hub, you go into this machine, you put what you're going to trade and the, what the other person is going to trade and no one gets scammed and stuff like that. It would be so awesome, man. I would love that so, so much, guys. Um, I hope you can still drop massive amounts of materials though because I actually got saved by a couple of subscribers because I was really low on Brightcore and all these other materials and you guys donated that to me. So thank you very much. Um, so that's the second thing that a hub um, would would do in Fortnite Save the World. And the third thing that it would do also is um, probably just add a couple of more features that I haven't even think about. And of course, that's when you guys come in, you know, what would be some features that a save the world hub would bring to the table that maybe I haven't thought about. I don't know, let me know in the comment sections below because uh, I'm sure you guys would love a hub in Fortnite Save the World and you guys have probably thought of some spicy ideas for it. Uh, this party royale hub to a lot of Save the World players, uh, you know, probably they were drowned in despair, but to me, this brand new mode kind of like gave me hope for Fortnite Save the World because if we do get something like this, if this is the big feature that say Epic is working on, it would be so, so awesome. Like a hub world would be an amazing thing that Save the World would benefit from big time. All right, new players would be able to learn. There could be like, you know, this party royale mode, something that I was thinking too is, we there's, there's like this green screen area on the hub and YouTube videos could be playing from that hub. So think about it. One of my tutorials <laughs> playing in the Save the World hub and new players are learning Survivor Squads. That would be so sick, dude. <laughs> like, look at this. Look at that. Just imagine that, guys. Like, But instead of loading screens, an actual YouTube video. You know, Save the World content creators having their videos displayed there in the Save the World hub so that other newer Save the World players or experienced Save the World players can also learn. That would be amazing, man. Anyways, is Save the World going to be getting a hub? Would you guys like a hub for Fortnite Save the World? How are you guys feeling that this Party Royale mode is one of the coolest things ever to come to Fortnite? And one of the things that would make a lot of sense in Fortnite Save the World and Save the World didn't get it. <laughs> Probably a lot of you guys are upset, but... I'm just gonna decide to be on the hopeful side of things and hope that we're getting some sort of hub in Fortnite Save the World that isn't half-assed and isn't full of bugs and isn't going to wipe inventories and isn't going to bring more issues than good things to save the world. <sighs> Damn. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, see you guys in the next one and um, let me know what you like the most about Party Royale and what you would like to see in a Save the World hub.